It's time for Tech Time with Timmy. Hello, welcome to Tech Time with Timmy. In this episode, Timmy's going to be talking about how to pair your phone with Google Home via Bluetooth. So, Google Home and Google Home Mini and Google Home Max are a really cool range of smart speakers that Timmy's talked about multiple times. And so, they're really cool. And they're so basically, you can ask them to play audio and you can do a whole lot of smart home control stuff as well. But you can ask them to play audio and you can cast audio from various different apps. And one, also, one other feature that's also really cool is you can actually pair them with Bluetooth. So, just like you might pair a pair of Bluetooth headphones to your phone, so you can play music from your phone onto the headphones, or you might pair a different Bluetooth speaker. You can actually pair your phone, or your laptop even, with Google Home as though it's a, a Bluetooth speaker, so it can work like that as well. So that's really cool. So, in order to do that, all you have to do is get one of your Google Homes. So, it has to be done on each different Google Home, because it's device-specific. But, so, you can get one of your Google Homes, whether it's a Google Home, or Google Home Max, or a Google Home Mini. Tim's using a Google Home Mini. And, so, what you need to do is say to Google Home, Hey, Google, connect Bluetooth. All right, looking for paired devices. So now Google Home is looking for paired devices via Bluetooth. So now what you need to do is go onto your phone, or it can be a laptop, and so you got to make sure Bluetooth is turned on, so do that. Usually it would be turned on. And so then all you need to do is go into the Settings app, and it varies based on device. If it's an older version of Android or iOS, it will might just say Bluetooth, right somewhere up the top of the settings, or it just says connected devices in the latest version of Android, which is what Timmy's using today. But it looks fairly similar, so you could probably figure it out. And so you tap on Bluetooth or connected devices, and some devices you might see all the available devices here, or other devices you might have to tap pair new device. So Timmy has to tap pair new device. And now it's found the device called Studio Speaker, so you can just tap on that and it says pairing. And it may take a few seconds. So you just wait for that, and now you heard the sound coming from the Google Home, and it says it's now paired, so that's really cool. So now what you can do is you can basically stream anything from your phone via Bluetooth. So it, if it's an app, if it's a music app that doesn't have cast, cast ability, you can just pair it with Bluetooth and play it like that. Or maybe if you're watching a video, you can pair it with Bluetooth and just hear the sound coming out of the Google Home, which you might want to do. Or if you're playing an audiobook or something. So it's just a really cool way that you can get any audio from your phone onto your Google Home really easily. And it can also be useful on your laptop if you want to have a nice, nice speaker for your laptop or something. So it can be really useful in many different ways to have Bluetooth connection. So that's really cool. And if you wanted to buy a Google Home or a Google Home Mini or a Google Home Max, then you can look at in the link in the description and click on it and buy it. So that would be really cool. And so that's really all there is to it, and that's really cool. And that'll be the end of this episode of Tech Time with Timmy. Bye.